All right, well, I guess I'm going to wait for level to get back. But um, guys, I wanted to show you this real quick. So uh, I have a replay mod going. I don't know exactly what, um, like how much time I have or how much the time lapse is going to cover. But uh, there's this <laughs> there's this crazy XP farm over here uh, right underneath. So a lot has happened. It's actually it's been a couple weeks. The server has been out for two weeks now. Um, so people have done quite a bit of stuff. Uh, but I haven't been able to because I've been getting in, moved into my new place. If you guys have seen my community post, I have uh, uh, I have shown shown you guys the new setup for the most part. I'm still working on it. So, um, but once I get it completely done, I plan on doing a setup tour, which I think will be really really neat. But <laughs> yeah, um, the thing I wanted to show you guys was this. So there's a bunch of alays there holding a bunch of terracotta and whatnot. Uh, and if we go down here, you can see there's a bit of silverfish heads and then. A lays inside free XP from ants, which is insane. Um, diamond block. I, I'm not I'm not sure exactly what that is. Uh, but yeah. So using the new 1.21 potions that they added, some infestation potions, and um, the like, using the lays. The lays, I think, have regen on them. I'm not entirely sure. I. Uh, I, I don't know exactly how this works, but uh, you ignite a campfire and you splash them with infestation potions. So we can go ahead and do that. Oh, unless my game crashes. Oh, there we go. Okay, so splashes them with infestation. Oh, I got to turn this down. This is super loud. But whenever a mob takes damage and they have this potion activated, they'll spawn silverfish around them. And so the f silverfish end up splashing over and going into this water stream and you just stand here and you hit this oh my gosh <laughs> you hit this uh arm armor stand so the splash damage will hit the silverfish through the blocks without them being able to hit you and you could just see the xp the amount of xp is insane with this so there's also i wanted to make a slime farm eventually uh utilizing these new potions because if you have a slime block and you put it into a brewing stand with some uh, awkward potions. You can make slime infested potions or whatever they're called. And whenever a mob gets killed, they spawn some slimes. And so you can just make a really, really easy, really nice slime farm out of that. Which I think will be super duper cool. Uh, right as soon as these potions came out, I instantly knew it was going to be an XP farm and an infinite slime farm. <laughs> Because the amount of slimes you get from one potion, especially if you have 20 mobs or whatever the mob cap is, if you have 20 mobs there and they all spawn like three slimes each, I think, uh, at like medium, at least medium slimes, I believe. Uh, so that will be what, nine small slimes and you have looting three sword. Oh my goodness, I can only imagine. That's just insane. So you set up like a, a skeleton mob spawner. Uh, so then they all gather in one place. You splash them with that slime potion. 20 of those skeletons will be infested with slimes. And you kill them all, and each of them spawn three. So that'll be like 60 slimes or whatever. And you gather them all in one place again. Oh. Uh, oh, and it's thunderstorming. Oh my goodness. <laughs> We're playing on hard difficulty, and <laughs> in between episodes, I was over... Um, I was uh, currently just about to get moved into my new place. So I was playing on a laptop before. Uh, and that's why there was a super crappy mic and that sort of stuff. But um, thank you, Razor Nari headset mic for coming in kind of clutch, I guess. It kind of hurt my ears to listen back to. But, you know, what can what can you say? Uh, so um, I was playing on a laptop. So I didn't have like the best performance whenever it came to actually playing the game. And I wanted to go mining because what what like what else am I supposed to do at the beginning of the game, right? And uh, I asked anybody if they had a fortune three pick that I could use. So then I could get like a crazy amount of diamonds. And I was offering up like a third of the diamonds that I collected. And I got like over half a stack of diamond blocks, like a full stack of uh, redstone blocks and lapis blocks and whatnot. Okay, so um, oh, no, that still ignites it. So water splash potion uh, gets rid of the um the campfire uh but 
yeah, so I had like a crazy amount of materials and I, I was just about to leave. Like I was like, OK, I, I feel like I'm done. And then I die to a crap ton of skeletons and I was fighting my way all the way to get back. I wasn't lighting up the place because I have the lamb dynamic lights. I don't have it on this PC, actually. Now that I think about it, I should probably get that. But I, I had that lamb dyna dynamic lights and so I wasn't placing down torches or anything like that. And uh, that was a big mistake because I had to fight all, all the way back and I think I died like 10 or 15 times. We could probably look at my statistics actually and see how many times I have died. Uh, number of deaths, 17. Yeah, I died like 15 times, I think. <laughs> and so, yeah, I uh, I couldn't really get back to my stuff. Um, and the five minute timer was almost up. And then I saw my stuff and I had to find a different way around because I only had like half health. And if I dropped down to where my items were, I would have died. So yeah uh also this drop down has killed me once now um kind of sad but you know it is what it is uh let's see what can i get on my sword smite four yes that's actually exactly what i want oh no oh fortune two yes oh my gosh that's a crazy pick i can combine these for 20 Ooh. yes we now have a fortune three pick so anyway, uh, long story short, I lost all my items. I saw it like right there and I only had like 30 seconds to get all the way around to it. And by the time I got dropped down, uh, all my items despawned right in front of my eyes. And that, that was the, one of the most upsetting moments in my Minecraft career, I think. But, you know, what can you do? You got to sometimes you win some, sometimes you lose, lose some. That's just Minecraft, right? Uh, even though it was very aggravating and I almost quit, but <laughs> luckily, uh, luckily, uh, Andrew or Albino Quackers, he, he came around and, uh, he hyped me up again to go back. So, you know, it is what it is, but I still owed Brandy a, uh, fortune three diamond pick. She said, don't worry about it, but I feel, I, I really feel bad. I feel very, uh, very in depth to her, uh, for that. And I feel like I should go mining once more. Uh, in order to get a crap ton of diamonds again um, and give them to her along with another fortune three pick uh, eventually and this xp farm down here is in freaking sane i'm i'm gonna go down there once again and i, I think i'm gonna get some more levels um i don't have any diamonds to make a diamond three pick so that's why i want to go mining because <laughs> i need money because there are a bit of shop at the shopping district that we need to go check out uh Let's see. Oh, I also need to buy some books uh, because this this sword is taking quite a bit of damage. But uh, let's go ahead. We're going to pop this open and get some more XP. Uh, so I'm going to do that real quick. And then I will be back. Uh, no. No. My best neighbor friend level is AFK. Let's go to the spider farm. I want to enchant another diamond sword. I think I, I got smite four on this sweeping edge three and looting three. Let's see what else I can get. Uh, because I, I definitely want smite on my diamond sword for sure. Oh. oh. <laughs> Okay, yes. Oh my gosh. Dude. <laughs> that is insane. Oh. Oh. Uh oh. Um. Run away, run away. I don't have any iron to fix it. I probably actually have iron at home. Dude, that, that, okay, that was a crazy enchant. I'm, okay, I'm so glad that I enchanted a new diamond sword. So let's actually go ahead. I need to go find my horse. Um, I, I put a saddle on it, but I left it at the mine that I died in whenever <laughs> I had that uh, fortune three pickaxe. So I want to go find that again. Uh, and um, then I'll probably go mining once more. Okay, I actually, I do not have any iron <laughs> i got 14 ingots oh my gosh okay uh let's see 
Let, let's walk around and see if anybody else has an anvil so I can combine uh, the Smite 4 sword here and the uh, regular Smite 4 sword. Make Smite 5 or something. Well, I need 11 levels, so it looks like uh, we are going to go down to the spider farm real quick and get just a couple levels. I don't want to use an infesting potion um, just for like four levels or whatever it was. And then once I get done with this, I think I'm going to go mining. Uh, I, I want to get a lot more diamonds. I need money for uh, for all of the stuffs. So let's go ahead and we'll... Wait here for a second and get some of these spiders to spawn. If they actually want to spawn, hello? There you go. Whoa, what is that? I think that's to prevent the spiders from climbing up the side, maybe? That's pretty neat. Okay, so we'll just wait here for a second. Uh, hopefully, I'll be able to get these guys in like one sweep, but we'll, uh, we'll see, I guess. Okay, hopefully this is enough. Yes. Perfect. And let's repair the sword. There we go. Okay, so let's go ahead. I gotta get my potato. And then we'll go over to Drew's base once more. Luckily, he has an anvil there. Don't tell Drew I'm using his anvil, though. He, he doesn't need to know, guys. I, it, trust me, he doesn't need to know. <laughs> so uh, let's call this... I think that's a suitable name. Okay, uh, let's go ahead and we'll get to mining. I, I, I really need to get some more resources. I want to I want to get uh, at least enough infrastructure myself uh, before we actually start working on a bunch of other building projects. Uh, okay, Level's having fun down, down in there. He's going to be FK for a while, so... Oh, I did not mean to do that. Can I go there? Sure. But... Let's go ahead. Uh, we got to go this way in order to find my horse. Um, so we're going to be be swimming for a second. Also, I think I can one-shot skeleton. So. Sure, we'll try that. Oh. Okay, so it's a two-shot with no crit. <laughs> oh, yeah, that's right. We have a looting three on the sword as well. Oh, that's so nice. Oh. Oh. Oh, Feather Falling 4. Oh my gosh. Feather Falling 4 is the best thing that I think has happened in Minecraft. Wow, what an atmospheric cave. So cool. Okay. Two poisonous potatoes. Out of my inventory. You buffoons. And I'm gonna eat this raw potato. Nice. Okay. I will put these buddies in here. Smoker will smoke them up all nice and ready. And I will be right back with you guys whenever those potatoes get done. I, I, I got to eat my baked potatoes. Hopefully, I can make them loaded baked potatoes. That would be pretty cool. Put some, like... I don't put sour cream. Low-key, I, low I kind of hate sour cream. I don't know if you guys like sour cream, but I don't really like sour cream too much. Yeah. But I usually I'll put like bacon bits or salt and pepper. Definitely salt and pepper. You can't go wrong with salt and pepper on baked potatoes. Uh, but yeah, that that'll be about it. Salt, pepper, bacon bits, maybe some, maybe sour cream if I'm really feeling it. But I don't like sour cream that much, as I said. So yeah, let, I want to know what you guys like on your your loaded baked potatoes. Okay, guys, I got all my baked potatoes, uh, luckily, and. Uh, let's go ahead. Uh, we're going to head out a little bit and try and find an area that I can go mining in. So hopefully uh, we can get a bunch of diamonds and a bunch of other resources that we need. Oh, what is this? Reserved for Pally. Ooh, Pally's moving into Hobbiton. Okay. Uh, yeah, so let's go ahead and go out a couple hundred blocks, I think. And uh, I'm going to go ahead and start mining. So hopefully you guys enjoy this nice little old time lapse of me going mining.
Alrighty, guys. So, uh, we're back, and I've completed uh, my mining trip. So, we're back at Hobbiton. There's a level down there. Chuckles just flew off, but uh, I thought I'd show you guys this real quick. So, uh, it seems uh, like I stumbled across J2 and uh, Quacker's little setup thing they have here. So items I can use is axe, helmet, chest plate, pickaxe. So I don't know what kind of game they're doing. So whenever they hop on, I'll, I'll go ahead and ask them and uh, see what see what, see what's going on. So I'm assuming this is maybe for like a mining trip to make it a bit more interesting or something. I'm not sure. But yeah, is that like a little smiley face or something? I don't know. Or like a J maybe. Uh, anyway, yeah, so this is a nice little hobbit hole down here. It's nice and like engraved and stuff. It looks really cool. I wonder whose base this is. Oh, nice little storage room. Dude, that actually looks really nice. And I need to turn my brightness back down to 30. There we go. 30 is like the best brightness, said B00. And I can agree. I think it looks really good. Sets the mood a bit more. But yeah, that's a nice little hobbit hole right there. Uh, it's becoming night. How do I get down without taking a bunch of damage? Ow. Um, I guess here, and then we can, oh, that was way too close. Oh my gosh, I almost died. Level, level. Hello. Oh my gosh, you're here. You're not AFK. I am not. I'm so happy. Dude, How did you? It sounds really good. Dude, nice. Yeah, it sounds nice and crisp. What about mine? Does mine sound better? So oh. much. Uh, how about you go inside the street? Yes, that is true. Wait, hold on. I need a... I forgot what the, the mini game is for this month. Oh, come here, Phantom. I want I want That's, your loot. I believe it's... Sweet. Nice. There we go. Okay. Or walking on water. <laughs> oh, yeah, that's right. Walking on water. Need to get Frostwalker, I think, for that, right? No, it's just literally, like, bobbing up and down in the water. Oh. Oh. Okay, well, if it's that easy, dang. I should have... I went, like, took the river basically all the way here after I got done mining. I should have done that instead of I'm swimming. I'm 14, k 14 kilometers. Okay, uh, well, so I don't think I'm going to be able to beat that. <laughs> um... That's insane. Maybe now it's this video? And I was like, damn, I sound awful. <laughs> <laughs> the consistency was bad. Like, on Drew's, I sounded really, like, loud. And I think on yours, it was, or vice versa. I don't know. I just sounded quiet and loud. And I was like, I just going to pick up a, a different mic. Because I had one of those on Walmart brand mics. <laughs> Oh, yeah. Okay, that makes a lot more sense. Yeah, I think your viewers are going to appreciate that, too. <laughs> oh, no. I For my videos, I use an Elgato Wave 3. Oh. For, like, th that was just so I could play Counter-Strike. Because I have two computers. A mm -hmm. recording and a gaming computer. And so for Counter-Strike, I was like, I need something so to allow me to talk. <clears throat> and so I bought, like, a quick, like, $15 mic. Wow. Okay. Yeah. That makes a lot more sense now. But I was like, I'm going to be in more videos. Oh, ah! sorry. <laughs> I didn't mean to do that. My my mouse is sensitive. I'm sorry. <laughs> Oops. <laughs> but because I'm going to be playing with people where they, it's just like this, I'm like, let me go get a nicer mic. And it's not like a super nice mic. I got uh, like one of those like little <laughs> razor sirens or whatever. Oh yeah, the like <laughs> siren mini things or mm -hmm. what, it was twenty nine ninety nine. No way! It was pink quartz. I will say the packaging was horrible, but it's brand new. <laughs> yeah, no, the uh, the mics, the, those razor sirens are actually pretty good. Sadly, yeah, they're I not. It was really sensitive, so if I'm like walking and talking, you can definitely hear. Oh my god! Yeah. I'm sorry. I keep doing that. I keep accidentally pressing it. <laughs> Uh, you want to see an update on my bee farm? Yes. Yes, I, I heard them all pop out whenever I went to sleep, and it, it sounds <laughs> insane. 
Then you have that so, honey shop, right? Yeah, that big honeycomb. Yeah, you have a lot of honey. So, it's nice and big in here. Okay, I'm There's not going to touch of... my mouse. <laughs> yeah, don't do that. I've mm -hmm. died once by uh, stings. Oh. And doing an old Minecraft trick. Make sure to crouch. Oh. Yeah, I got it. Hit my head. Hopefully I'll have a concussion. Ooh. It's actually really simple, but you can see why I'm like, I need a redstone farm. Yeah. So, sometimes these hoppers don't always pick it up, so they go on the ground, so this is what the um, minecart is for, to pick up the excess that doesn't actually go in there. Yeah. And luckily, I have learned in a 24-hour span, not a lot actually ends up on the ground, but if it does, it at least gets picked up. Yeah. Okay. And then this is the newest edition, where I uh, will have it automatically shoot down. So the only thing I have to worry about is oh. filling uh, oh. models. Oh, oh, level. Oh no, you're using a a, re <laughs> a repeater clock. Ah, I, yeah, you know I'm not great at redstone. Oh gosh. Okay, you do have quartz. Okay, I'm I'm about to like blow your mind. Thing, I'm pretty sure there's, uh, if you're gonna make com a comparator, I have those. No, 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 no. Uh, you're, you're, you're about to get your mind absolutely blown. What, what are you making? Okay. Gonna gonna make make oh. Oh. <gasps> <laughs> the shulker box. Dang it. That works. Perfect. Okay. Are you making like a redstone comparator? No, it's not. Not not gonna be a comparator. Alright. What makes what okay. imports what? You you're you're about to get your mind absolutely blown. So instead of uh Yeah, 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 I can I can use this. Use these blocks. Okay. So a even faster clock that you can do is using observers. Oh, I had those too. Boom. So quick. Okay, well, see, the clock was great because of the thing I'm about to show you. It did work. Hopefully I didn't break anything. <laughs> you shouldn't have, but it is now like three times faster, which is fine, hopefully. No. Oh. Another Minecraft trick. <laughs> Holy I, it, smokes. Yeah, it's just so this doesn't get over flooded. That is true. You could... Uh, you could probably put, like, a cobweb or something up in there, so then it all gathers I mean, in one set. to be fair, there is just an excessive backlog I'm dealing with right now. So, once that backlog is done, oh. it should never, like, actually... I, I see, I... I see, oh my, how many, oh my goodness. <laughs> oh yeah. Oh my so this storage room is solely for Honeycomb. <laughs> Dude, that is, <laughs> so is that only a Honeycomb farm or do you change it out for bottles and stuff like that? So half of it's bottles, the other half is Honeycomb. Wow. <laughs> And, but I have an excessive amount of honeycomb that I need to store, and I didn't want to do it by hand, so I just kind of put it in through the hoppers. Mm -hmm. And so it was slowly going through. Dude, that is... And I just didn't... In the redstone clock, I was like, okay, it should be fine for now, because then once it shoots it off, and it was repeating at one tick speed, which was great, so at least because, like, everything hoppers go at one tick speed mm -hmm. and so it was just like it would land get sent land get sent land get sent and now it's starting to back up a little bit oh okay that makes a lot more sense uh but maybe i was like to be and i was like with how uh do you have a chest by chance like do you think putting a, a chest right before it drops down into the hopper would work? Oh, it should be fine here in like a minute. I don't think it should get clogged up at all. Okay. 
Yeah, because now the honey honey's coming down as well. Yeah, perfect. So that okay. means it's starting to. Sweet. The backlog is starting to exit out. Yeah, it's, I don't think it should stack up for more than five minutes. Hopefully. <laughs> the honey bottles is what's really going to back this thing up, though. Yeah, now, now the hopper's full. So any honey bottles are going to sit there for a second. Yeah, I'll just take those out. Oh, that's such a satisfying noise, though. <laughs> like the items dropping into the water. Ooh. Yeah. I only, that's why I was AFK, just so I could let that run and, like, have my sand melt. Because I'm like, I don't know where everybody is. And most of the time, Hobbiton is loaded in. But that's not... I was like, oh, I'm just going to make sure it's loaded. Right. That makes sense. Well, I got... I have 37 le levels. I feel like I should enchant a diamond pick or something now. Oh, I'm going to... Uh... I'm gonna leave the repeaters in a chest. <laughs> Time to make a diamond pick. Hopefully I get fortune three on it so I can repay Brandy. <laughs> Cause I feel I feel very indebted to her for dying that that time. <laughs> I feel so bad. Yeah, that, that, like, I logged on, uh, yesterday, I think, for, like, a, a few minutes, just so I can, like, play on my setup, see how everything is, and I saw all the progress that's been made, I'm like, no way, <laughs> like, I stepped away I for, say, like, four days. I will say, I didn't realize this until, like, today, but somebody took down my staircase up to you and replaced it with the other staircase, I'm like, oh! My staircase is gone. It's like, wait a minute. Wait, 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 wait. Yeah. I think it was Brandy because she did all this. Oh, okay. That makes sense. And Pally has an area reserved over there, that, like, flat kind of wall right there. So, that's pretty interesting. I wonder what Pally's going to be doing. Whoa. Yeah. You see that cool chimney using the decorated pods? With the campfire? Oh, yeah. That's neat. Okay. Well, I'm going to enchant this pick. Oh, no. Oh, I forgot. Oh, this is bad. Oh, gosh. Ow. You darn phantoms. Get off my lawn. Yeah. Yeah, get out of here. Yes! 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 Let's go! Dude, heck yes! Oh my gosh! No way! <laughs> On the last enchant I had for level 30. Oh yes! I can finally repay Brandy! Oh! Holy smokes, guys! Oh my goodness! Level! Level, you won't believe it! What's up? On my last level 30 enchant, I got a fortune 3 efficiency 4 and breaking 3 pick. Nice. I can finally repay Brandy. Do you have a, an anvil? I do. Oh, can I use it? Yeah. Okay, I'm going to rename it. Uh, Spelling your name right. <laughs> there we go. Okay. Well, I'm going to go ahead and give this to Brandy with a few diamond blocks, I think, because I did owe, I did owe her like a third of my diamonds for that mining trip, and dude, these pathways are really freaking cool too. So glad that <laughs> this stuff has been happening on the server. It's, it's crazy to see. Uh, stables. I wish I could use a horse. I mean, I would bring it back, but at the same time, I don't want to get it killed by accident and then owe somebody a horse. So, yeah, we're just gonna, we're gonna move along. Um, oh my gosh. All this propaganda for Matt to be mayor. Hopefully people actually think it's annoying, because that would, that would improve my odds, but at the same time, I don't know if I want to be mayor. <laughs> I, I genuinely don't know if I want to. I don't know what it would entail. I don't know, like, what would happen. <laughs> it's, 
Uh, okay, yeah, so this is the, the shopping district, also known as Spawn. So there's a few shops around, um, a bunch of space that we, everybody can fill in and whatnot. So there's a pot shop here, yeah. um, which sells big pots and the decorative pots, small pots, like the regular flower pots, clay and pottery shirts, which is neat. Uh, there's a chicken shop here, which... Okay. Wait, do you go through here and then it launches you? No way, that's sick. Welcome to the egg, where all your debts can be paid in a matter of seconds. Let me ask you one thing. Are you tired of not having as many diamonds as your friends? If the answer is yes, then this is the place for you. The rules are simple. Put a diamond in the chest and if a chicken spawns from the egg it shoots out, you win four diamonds. That is right, you can turn your lousy one diamond into four and on and on. Finally, you won't be the poorest one in the group. After all, no one likes poor friends. The rules, one diamond potentially spawns one chicken. If a diamond spawns, four diamonds shoot out from the top. If a chicken doesn't spawn, I keep your diamond. To the right of the chicken tube is the copper block with signs next to it. If it is in the ceiling, do not play. If a chicken does spawn, you will not get any diamonds. Maximuso is not legally obligated to refund you any diamonds in this case. Okay, so All right, so it looks like it's clear So our diamond goes in here. Okay, so this is the gambling game that I've been hearing about so if we go ahead and Put in one diamond should spawn a chicken. Oh Oh no guys, I'm gonna get addicted Oh no. Oh gosh. Oh, just come on, just spawn one. Please. Please just spawn one. Yeah, I just want four diamonds. Please. Alright, you know what? Um I'm just gonna I'm just gonna leave. I, I gotta leave. I can't uh okay, he just made like what, nine diamonds off of me? <laughs> no. uh, I don't like having a, a gambling addiction. Uh, okay, so that way is to Pally's. There's the Shulker Shop is over here, which it is really cute. Just a panda. All right. Um, this shop is the Buttercups Boutique. Boutique? Oh, Mending. I'm breaking three. Inner chest, three diamonds, scaffolding, three stacks for one diamond. Oh, everybody bought inner chest. ATM. Power five, fire aspect two, fortune three, silk touch, efficiency five, protection four. Wow, efficiency five. That must have taken a little bit to get. Well, actually, never mind. They probably have villagers for that, right? Protection four, unbreaking three, mending. So how much, how much are the mending books? Five diamonds each or three for 13. Okay, well, we're gonna go ahead and take three, of course. Uh, pay here. 13, there we go. Payment in. And we got three mending books. Heck yeah, hopefully that gets stocked up soon because I do want to put some on my armor, I think, especially my boots and my helmet. Sure, we'll do that, I guess. Okay, let's go over to Brandy's. I need a I need a give her this pickaxe and to Brandy's base in the desert. So I need to give Brandy this pick and I need to give her a couple diamond blocks. Cause yeah, I, I kinda need a repair. <laughs> I kinda feel bad. This is pretty neat. I think she's turning a village into her base, setting up pass and whatnot. That's pretty nice. Uh, <laughs> cow farm. Dude, the new dogs look so freaking sick. I love the new dog models that they have. Uh, it looks so good. Oh, little creeper. Oh, man. Let's see. Where can I put this pickaxe? I think I think we just put an X in another portal. I think that's going to be the, the most valid place to put this. Let's go ahead and make chest and do that. Let's make a sign as well. 
So we'll put that in there and then we'll get out our wallet. <laughs> uh, yeah, I think four, four diamond blocks will do. There we go. Nice. Whoa, it's a wheat field. Did you guys not realize that? It's a wheat field. Okay, let's go ahead and go back. Uh, and uh, let's just go back to Hobbiton. We'll, ha we'll have fun over there, I think. I'm back level. I gave Brandy her stuff. Mission success. Yo, mission accomplished. Heck yeah. I wonder what, why there's like random buttons with bones. What? There's like random buttons up here with like bones in them over by my place. I don't know exactly what this is. But they don't do anything. I think they're just decorative. Oh yeah, I think they're just bugs. Oh, they're bugs? Oh, I see it. They're like big flies. <laughs> Or horse flies. Yeah. We'll just say that. Oh. Oh, yeah. Lee Man lives in between us now. Who? Lee Man. Or Le Man. Le Man. Oh, that's right. Le Man. Oh. <laughs> it's supposed to be Brattles, but he didn't want. <laughs> Le Man needs. Because I think he was supposed to move in, but. He didn't. Yeah, this is a pretty neat little whole thing. Oh, this is all it's gonna be. <laughs> that makes sense. She has her own place, but she wanted to be included here. in the Hobbiton. Yeah, she yeah. wanted to build a house. So I was like, neat. oh, I feel so bad. I took so much space underneath you guys. She's like, oh, that's about it. We, we aren't gonna live there. It's just... <laughs> so I was like, oh, okay. It's like, oh, okay. I'll, I don't feel so bad anymore. Heck yeah. Well, guys, I think that's going to be it for this video. I hope you all enjoyed. Uh, we, I feel like it was a pretty successful video. I mean, we enter. Oh, what is that? Oh, God. <laughs> we interacted with Level quite a bit. We paid off our debt to Brandy, gave her a diamond pickaxe back, and a couple diamond blocks uh, to say thanks. So, yeah, I hope you all enjoyed. If you did, remember to hit that like button down below. Subscribe if you're new here. And I will see you all in the next episode. Have a good day. Bye-bye.